here, you can see that uh, in this wood blocking, on the top of it there's some shims that are stuck in there and there's a gap. So I bet you that you got cold air coming through there. So I'm going to fill up at that little hole that I just put right in the middle there. And I'll also probably squirt some stuff right up top there. Um, so to try to fill it up. Plus I'll put insulation on the top of it and then I'll uh, air seal around the outside of that. So just a ton of stuff. So I'm going to put about, I don't know, 20, 15 seconds of foam into each one. And then I'll go back with the second can. So these cans only work well when they're upright like this. So I might have to put a hole in low. All right, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to put a hole in low. So I got to go get my, got my drill again right here. Okay. Okay. So those are three holes. All right. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. If I had infinite money, I take like two cans per cavity and just nuke it full and then clean up any excess that came spurting out the side. And you can still feel the can like clicking away in your hand like you can feel it pushing out foam. Not as much, it's kind of like a sputter. So we're kind of getting to the end of the can life here. The question is, where's the foam going to come out? Hopefully it fills up the whole cavity, but who knows? That's pretty good. Oh. Now I'm going to wait for that stuff to kind of dry and cure, and then I'll hit off the extra little bits that are on the front of the spray from that drive, so I have a nice flush service to put this uh, foam board to. All right, folks, we're back. It's been, I don't know, about an hour. As you can see, the spray foam has come out the top in one long spot there and come down. And it came out in those other areas too. So perhaps um, it really expanded in there and filled up well. On the other one, you see it leak out there at the bottom and a little bit up at, out at, up at the top there in the left-hand corner and in the middle there. And the right one, uh, a little bit in the middle there, and down the right-hand corner. So I put about, I don't know, uh, oh, like 0.75, or a little less than 0.75 cans in each one. And that's how we did. So uh, probably in a little bit, I'll break that stuff off and then put the other ones, put the, uh, the, the foam on, which is waiting right there. And I'm going to use that caulk. 